Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming with another episode of State of Decay 2 Homecoming. Alrighty, when we left off, we were needing food, but uh, we're going to eventually get a hydroponics going. Uh, I'm still debating whether I need to teach our team member who doesn't have any skills at least any extra skills. Uh, it wasn't Abby. It was a Jilly Bean. Whether or not I want to teach her utilities or computers. Because, well, everyone else is pretty well set. <laughs> Honestly. Everyone else has a skill of some kind. So, I'm honestly thinking utilities. But beyond that, no idea. <laughs> anyway. We have water and power. So, what the what? Don't need to do anything with that. What, why is it showing with a mark on it? What? What do? I have no idea. No idea why it's showing with a mark on it. Oh, that's... That's broken. That's what that is. <laughs> the quest is broken. Okay, that's what it is. Alright, anyway. Bootleggers needed help to do the still. That was what we were going to do. So we're going to go do that. Let's get ready to do that. Uh, I have... All the equipment I really need. So let's go ahead and get into one of the trucks. Presume this one would be good. Eh, need some fuel, but otherwise, okay. Alright. Well, hi there, y'all. <laughs> well, they weren't here for long, were they? Okay, I narrowly avoided hitting that. I call that a win. I call it a win. I looked away for one second and ran into that because I was like, my microphone level. That's on me. That's all on me. Boom. Alright. Good enough. And take you Goodbye. Let's talk to the bootleggers now. Alright. Hello. Ready to pick up a few things for the still? Sure, why not? Hey, the Santos Legacy turned on. Good. I'll have to get started on that soon, too. Hey, a beer in the morning is the best way to survive the apocalypse, don't you think? I'm not sure yet. Mm. We'll find out, I guess. A cello to look for parts for the still. Okay. Didn't even notice that dropped. Good. I'm also kind of surprised that I was able to get that out of their outpost. Considering I wasn't supposed to be able to do that. Maybe it was because I had searched it before it became their base. Maybe that's why. That makes sense, actually. Okay. Anyway. Time to get the parts. The trader has left the area. They would. Didn't figure it would take that long. Okay, we. Okay, that's not. Oh, oh, that's infested. Mm -hmm. How bad is the infestation there? Oh, it's got one screamer. That isn't too bad. In fact, if I'm lucky, it's right there. Really? You're not gonna let me kill it easily, huh? Okay, well. They're coming in from multiple sides. Well, I mean, it is an infestation. Kinda how they do. <laughs> Did 
There we go. That was what I was hoping for. Down it eventually went. Now we can head in and deal with the rest. Way too noisy. Without having to worry too much. Don't tell me that's a juggernaut I'm hearing. That is a juggernaut I'm hearing. Joy. Fantastic. We're screwed. Don't. Don't go out there. You're, you're the drunk. You're not going to be very good in fighting. Anyway. Okay. It's going to be a problem. Yeah, you're going to be tired. I'm trying to keep the drunk character from dying. Which is kind of what she's doing very well right now. Okay, I rolled right into that, but at least I didn't get hurt from it. Okay. Okay, that one I got hurt from. There we go. That was what I was hoping for. Damage. Beautiful. Ish. Jesus. That should have gone worse than it did. Okay. I'll be okay, just need a sec. Okay. Gracias. I'll take care of it. I cannot find the other Zambambo. That's counting this as an infestation. I can't find it. There's no way it's on the roof, is it? Possible. No. No, it's not, so... That was a waste of time. Oh, well. Where could it be, then? Be just outside? I did hear something outside. Um, uh, maybe it is. That it was. I see. Okay, well, we did the thing now. Ta-da. That'll teach me to move too fast. Balls. This is gonna slow me down a bit. Oh, you're fine. Well, at least she's managing against normal Zambambos. It's the big freakazoids. That's where she has problems. Alright. Let's tuck all of this good stuff away. Big old shovel. All the good stuff here. And the extras. What else should I do with some of those weapons I picked up? Because I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I'm doing... Decent in the shovel department. Drive shafts. They're a bit heavy. They're a bit heavy and not really worth the durability. Mm, I'm gonna delete. Destroy this. Delete, destroy, and get the parts from it. Okay. Now we head over to where we get the parts. <laughs> okay. Why you always decide to jump? Jump. Jump in the truck bed. Don't know how it became jump. Not far off. Well, I mean, they're kind of all over the place. So, you know, it's kind of their shtick. Alrighty. Goodbye. And uh, now we move on. Ow. Ow. Oh, oh god. Oh, oh, sorry. Not feeling too good. Are you okay? You get bit by a plague zombie? Uh, 
Not unless Plague Zombie is a brand of beer. Ah, oh, Jesus. Of course. Of course. Oh, that was almost, almost bad. Okay. Try to back out as much as possible so that way I can deal with them for safety. All right, we can stop worrying so much about infestations. At least for a while. Yeah. Find out what's wrong with her. She's drunk. That's what's wrong. Not feeling too good. Warm beer. Maybe due to the fact you can't get refrigeration very easily, maybe you shouldn't be drinking the beer. I'm not sure which way I want to go with this. Take a rest. I'll handle the situation. Thank you. All right. Where are those parts they needed? Right there. Beautiful. Did you look at that? All the parts they needed. Give her the parts for the still. Thank you. I'll let you know when we've got the still set up. Well, I guess right now we can be honest about it. You need to get your shit together. You could have gotten me killed. Bye. Rather dismissive. That line, but okay. Alrighty. Well. I'd say we did good there. Good to see you. Come in. Nah, I don't need to, but I appreciate the invitation. I need to check some of the buildings. If there's any good loot to be had. Ow. Bastard. That one's not dead yet. There you go. Perfect. Alrighty. How is this building lootable? <laughs> Rather, why is it marked white when there's clearly no way to get into it? Oh, man. Okay. Revolting storefront. Okay. So it just means it's secured and has been looked at. That's really what it means. Okay, well. It's just mean. Okay. Well, some zombies running around that spot. All clear. Ooh. Can't turn this place down. That's not too bad, I guess. No, it's not. Really not? Good find, old man. Ooh, duck. Very fine, old man. Wow. And no one was here to see me do that. Tragic. Alright, well. Let's check some of these other buildings out. Clear. Ooh, even more building materials. I'm okay with that. And a gas can. Beautiful. Alright. Let's go get my car and wheel it over here since this seems to be the section of town that I can actually loot. <laughs> Booyah. gas can in the truck because we're going to be moving around quite a bit doing our looting there we go had to get some of my energy drink in any my friendly tea. folks out there want to come over and give me a hand sure why not it actually works this yep, time I'm on it that's the... I'll keep my eyes peeled for you. 
That's the trick, really. If it works, it doesn't break on me. Well, hi there. Goodbye. Let's get some of those materials out of there. Damn, we should have hit this place a while ago. We just hit it, Tom. Come on, man. Jesus. All right. We have a lot of materials, and do we need that many materials? I don't think we do. I honestly don't think we do. I mean, we have the space for them, don't get me wrong. I'm just not sure if we need them all that badly. If nothing else. If nothing else. We put towards the hydroponics. Which I do need to get onto eventually. Just teaching Jilly Bean utilities and then having the hydroponics option available will be a very, very good idea. Did I hear a feral? Or was that just a normal Zambamba? No, that was a feral. Let's see if we can run over. Oh. <laughs> we did. That was beautiful. It was absolutely beautiful. All right. Where? Yep. Where's this putz? Hey, what up, Buttercup? Let me lay it out. Mm hmm Those plague walls all over town. They didn't come down on their own, right? I heard mm -hmm. the military developed some super anti-plague weapons, and I just know they left some behind. Right. Grab your big guns. You don't want to fuck around with this one. Okay. You ready to do this? Let's see okay. what you got in your pockets. Not a lot, but you got something at least. All right. Grab your big guns. Yeah, let's Sweet. do it. So downtown is pretty messed up, but there's a ton of military shit left everywhere. Oh, there so... There are a couple of spots in particular I want to check out. Gotcha. Not Sounds the same fun. guy, but talks the same way. Alright. Are we there yet? Oh, that's a lot of Zeds. Yes, it is. In there, am I right? I got serious doubts about this plan. Yeah, me too. Come on. The fact that you've never heard of a big secret weapon just proves it definitely exists. Right. Uh huh. That's totally logical. Alrighty. I think all the Zambambos are cleared. Oh. Not yet. Now they are. Wait for Gage to search. sake mm -hmm. it's not here but i'm not giving up so easy uh-huh i know another spot that's gotta have what we're looking for you're still in right sure <sighs> fucking awesome okay guess on point i guess i am i guess i am so i'm gonna drop off my junk <sighs> That I'm carrying in my pockets to, into here. That, that, and that. I'm not gonna need all of it. Cool. Alrighty. And I could probably make it there via truck. Probably. Key phrases, probably, but I could maybe manage it. This big old pumpkin truck. And boom. Up to you. And going around all the other cars in the area. Whoopsie diddle. And 
you out. And I guess this is about where my ability to travel ends. And I also powers it. Wowzers. How did I manage this? Okay. Okay. There we go. It's all good now. It's fine. Okay. Now we walk over. And hopefully that's got to be the place. The mission doesn't break again. There are all the Zambambos from the army cache so you can search the site. Okay. Oh yeah. Damn, that was a tough one. No, it wasn't. I did all the work. Where the hell would it be? They literally just phased it into yeah, being. Found it. You found it? They are literally phasing into being this location. I mean, you guys are seeing that, right? They're phasing into being. That's this weird. has to be it. But to be sure, let's go find a jug and try it out. Sure. Okay. Fucking awesome. To hunt a juggernaut. Well, I mean, it's getting me further in the mission than it was last time. And let's see what we got in here. Just parts. Okay, that's fine, I guess. This location has nothing. Nothing of worth anyone. Alright. And... I hit kill. I hit the kill button. Jesus. X marks the spot, baby. Alrighty. Find and kill the jug near the Blaine's fortified grocery. There we go. It'd be nice if you followed me. There we go. All right, beautiful. And keep clear of that juggernaut, kids. Or, you know, we get him over to where our buddy is. Your horses, will ya? Uh, I'm trying to get the jug to you. <sighs> Come on. Come on, buddy. Let's walk on over here. Oh, great. <laughs> and it's bug. They won't let me get him from over here. Okay. I'm about to say, I was pretty sure this place was clear. And now these zombies are just standing there, not doing really anything. Combat wise. That's wild. Okay. I just spotted a bloater. <laughs> Where's the bloater? Oh, there it is. There it goes. Took a while. Is <laughs> able to blow through that? Okay. Come on. Come on, buddy. Come on. You're kidding me. You're absolutely kidding me. Alright, well, I guess I shall run. We just brought a zombie shambling to our base. Oh, Is nice. Good. Perfect. Well, at least I'm getting you involved in the fighting. Aren't you supposed to use that big old jug killing super weapon, buddy? Aren't you supposed to use that? Okay, well, aha! Gotcha. So tired. Okay. Yeah, I spotted a freak. 
You spotted a freak. We're literally fighting the freak. Dumbass. And kill. This bad boy kicks ass. You didn't even use it. Okay, it's decided. I'm taking my new zombie killing act on the road to make a name for myself. I hear Danforth is pretty nice this time of year. Maybe I'll head that way. Have fun out there. Police auction Here's golden a something, vulture. You know, for the effort. Keep your powder dry, buddy. Sure. Well. <laughs> Police auction golden vulture. Firearm once owned by an idiot, full of sound and fury. Perhaps in your hands it might signify something. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's <laughs> too big for the holster <laughs> that's in these pants. <laughs> oh, wow. It is big enough. Look at that. Look at that. You can see it beyond the brim of the gun. It's so big. The brim of the hat. brim of the gun. <laughs> oh, I'm so baffled by its beauty. By its... Nah, it's not really that beautiful. It's gold, so it's gaudy. But that's not the point. <laughs> the point <laughs> is that it is definitely something worth having. Okay. Well, that takes care of that. Um, probably should head home now, I guess. And I'm definitely not carrying that thing on my hip the entire time. That is not what I meant to do. No. No. I meant to equip it. There we go. Have my good gun on my hip. The one that actually works. <laughs> Without having to blow through ammo I don't have. And now you're just standing there instead of going to Danforth like you said you were going to. Whatever. Whatever. Not too shabby. Yeah, at least I'm killing Zambo. Although it seems all of them in this area are <laughs> What the fuck was that? It seems they're all bugged to just stand there and then teleport on top of fences. What the absolute tits? Oh, whatever, man. I'm so confused. Oh, everything. Everything is so weird in the middle of this town. It's so weird. There we go. Now we're good. Yeah. And yeah. In the center of town, it all gets fucky. But in the outskirts, it seems to be working the way it's supposed to. Which is really weird to me. Well, hello, Mr. Bloater. How you doing? You are not getting any closer than you could. Goodbye. Oh, Goodbye. Alrighty. We're good. Now we head home. And do do all those turns. Better move on. That one was bound to be bad. I had a feeling it was going to be a bad turn. Alrighty. I was hoping. I was hoping the back end of the truck would get it. I was hoping. Back it up and top. All right. Yeah, it just seems the AI in the middle of Marshall just kind of breaks down, like significantly. I'm not sure why, but it seems to. But uh, once you're on the outskirts of the town or in other sections of the town, it seems to work fine. Don't understand it. It's weird really weird but whatever there we go park in dropping all this off 
go. What? If I see anyone give up, I'll shoot you myself. What were you doing? Yay for you! <laughs> Who did that? Okay, um. Abby. Yeah, Abby needs to boost her. <laughs> She's over here just dusting down this area <laughs> with a broom. Because she d doesn't have enough of a rep. Well, shit. Well, let's. Set siege underway! Let's build up her rep, shall we? Wow, I have nothing. I have nothing on that. Behold. Hold the line! Jeez. We can do this! Okay. Give her a kukri. Um. Okay, well, wow. You think we got Took him? Took him a while, but they got him. Close the door so that doesn't happen again. Shall we? Pretty much the entire time is going to be me luck. equipping her with stuff. That's going to be what happens here, isn't it? Just the entire time. Come on, guys. Let's show the Zeds what we're made of. Okay. Well, let's repair this. Yeah, there we go. Something. And then load this up. Hey, Clear out the remaining Zeds, alive. and we're good. Recruit has greatly increased in standing, which is all I was really hoping for. Is that if I swap to her, it would work out that way. And let's get her a decent backpack. Yeah, there you go. Should be good enough. There you go. Goodbye. Fantastic. Fantastic. Alright. Wasn't that bad at all. Wasn't at all that bad. I was trying to figure out what her skills... Yeah, she can't really do fighting all that well. She's a flincher. But everything else might be good. Yeah, everything else is good. Yeah, everything else can work out. Just she isn't that good of a fighter. Just everything else she can be good at. She's just fine by me. Just fine by me. All right, so let's build her up a little bit since Tom needs a rest. And have her doing things. Like what? I don't know. Um, Copy. Yeah, we'll get on it. Yes. ASAP. Probably Ray's last known residence, the Red Farmhouse. How's fuel doing on this one? Oh, the Tiger Claw is doing great on fuel. Okay. Well, in that case, I'll just drive it around for a little bit. Break through that one fence. All right. Hey, Lily. I'm near that location you just shared, but the house looks empty. Huh. The Valley Denizens. Got one person in there. And there's a car over here? Oh, it's a van. Oh. And it's a decent intact van. Interesting. Hmm. We got a deadhead problem. I trust you'll fix it. Heart to heart. Okay, we'll get to that in a second. Huh. Search for any sign of Ray Santos. Okay. Looks like he... Yeah. He really isn't here. Hmm. 
Whoop. Almost missed that. Ray, we're tired of waiting for you to deliver on your promises. We're leaving Trumbull. Well. Hmm. This doesn't explain where he is. I better keep looking. Yep. Map to supply stashes. This map depicts a small section of Trumbull Valley. A note at the bottom reads, Hello, neighbor. Please use the supply stashes designated on this map to restock as needed. Or just come by to say hi. It's signed by Ray Lily, Santos. Lily, you read me? I'm out here looking for Ray, but all I found is a map of some nearby farms. Travel to the nearby location in search of Ray. So, about these infestations. Time to do something? Yeah, in a bit, in a bit we shall. Actually, now I think about it, where is the nearest one? Oh, it's in Marshall, okay. House by the pileup. I could definitely take that out. Especially if it's only one screamer there, I could easily take that out. Not a problem there at all. I should eventually get rid of this play card. Should eventually do that. Alrighty. Now that I know that this van is here, I might at one point come out here and grab it. Because I think it'll be worth it. Alright. Nearby house was over here. <laughs> You ran right into it, you idiot. Oh. Well, hello. I'm assuming you're who I'm looking for. Huh. I figure in they'd be following me. Guess I didn't want to. Hello, I'm Ray. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Let me guess. Lily sent you out looking for me because I haven't returned her calls. Yeah. Uh, I should be upset, but the truth is I could use a little help. Oh, yeah? Uh, I thought I had stashed some useful medicine here, but now I'm thinking the clinic up the road is my best bet. Okay. You mind keeping me company? I'm not moving as fast as I used to. Fair enough. Okay. Hey, the clinic I need to search isn't very far. Do you mind tagging along? Do you really need my help? My body keeps reminding me I'm not a young man anymore. I've just uh, racked up too many miles, I'm afraid. That I understand. So what do you okay. say? Can you help me out? Absolutely. Thank you. Sincerely. The clinic is just up the road. It shouldn't take long to get there. Cool. After you. Sounds good to me. Yeah. If you say so. But first, I'm looting this thing. Oh, this again. Fabulous. I mean, Molotovs are good, Abby. You don't need to be complaining about it. Oh yeah. It's a beautiful shot. Considering I don't have a scope on this thing. About here. <laughs> that was actually good. About here. Uh, might I could get a little higher. Oh you bastard. Need to move just at the moment I didn't need you to. Beautiful. At least I got two of my shots. Rather, all three of my shots. There we go. I was about to say, I hope I can find the other one, but I think it's long gone. Okay. Well, escort Ray. Oh, are you kidding me? That juggernaut was not there a minute ago. Alright, Ray, come on. Is that another? That is another intact minivan. Rather, actually, proper van. Get in the truck, please. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Oh boy, that juggernaut was not there five seconds ago. That was bullshit. All right, let's head over to that clinic. I do not want to know what makes plague territory smell this bad. Uh, a lot of death, a lot of blood, and a lot of biological waste. 
willing to bet more Did than happen most. between you and the people who lived back at that house? I'm afraid I let them down one time too many. I keep pretending like I'm a young, healthy guy, promising what I can't deliver. I just hope they don't blame Lily and the network for my failures. They probably will, unfortunately. That's how it goes when it comes to leadership. Sad to say. Okay, I guess it's time to start searching the place. I guess it is. How about we clear out the zombies first? That's a good idea. Yeah. There we go. Probably good. Got a zombie approaching. Oh yeah. I know what they do best. Uh oh. Let Ray get bit. Not too much. There we go. Yeah, not too bad. Not too bad. Claimed by a plague heart. Ah, crap. Thanks for your help. I can handle things from here. You sure? I just need to find some painkillers and then rest here for a while. Ray, I get the feeling there's something you're not telling me. I apologize, my friend. I... I suppose I owe you the truth. The fact is... Well... The fact is I'm dying. What? You're dying? Yeah, I'm afraid it's the big C. Cancer. Cancer? Shit. Sorry about that. Uh, but how can you be sure? I watched my father go through the same thing a long time ago. Yeah, my uncle too. And now it's my turn. Even with so much work left to do. But uh, please keep this quiet. Not many people know, and uh, I don't want folks worrying about me. <laughs> Look, if I need more help, I promise to give you a call rather than getting into trouble by myself, okay? All right, Ray. Be safe. And we'll talk again soon. Take it easy. Fucking A! Ah, so that was why I got the weak painkillers bottles. All right. Well, it's unfortunate to hear about Ray, but at least he's willing to call us, get help from us, instead of just consistently promising what he can't deliver. Which, when you know that you have a family history of cancer, you should probably be aware that it's more likely going to happen to you. Something I have to worry about. Father's side had skin cancer. This might be useful. Which is kind of good that I'm a homebody and I avoid being out in the sun for too long because that's probably going to extend my life quite a bit. Although, father passed from a uh, combination stroke and heart attack in that order. So, also got to worry about my weight and my diet, which is not that easy. You live by yourself and are living paycheck to paycheck. So, it's one of those things you just got to deal with. I'm running into a lot of vans. Holy tits. Are, they're intact. And if they're full of fuel... Not, <laughs> I gotta think that this was Ray. This was all Ray. This had to be all Ray. The fact that there's so many vans well maintained and full of fuel... At pretty much every location where I've, you know, been around where Ray is supposed to be, or, you know, been near Ray, I gotta assume it's a nod to the fact that Ray was the car guy in the first game. It's the only thing that makes sense. Oh boy. Definitely going to have to deal with the plague hearts here and here. I kind of want to go up to the mountain, though. Head right back up to where it all began. That'll be later, though. That'll be later. As it is right now, I should be heading home. Feral's killed with a blade. I still haven't done that yet? Oh, 
gosh. I need to do that. Mainly so I want... I <laughs> Mainly because I want to get that bounty. So, uh, when I see a feral, I will do that. But, uh... In the meantime... Might as well end the episode as I'm heading home. So... Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos. And if you want to see more, click the like button if you like this particular video. Share in comments so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. Hey, folks. One and only Stray Cat playing games and... Well, can, but humor me. <laughs> playing games and trying to help the communities around us one step at a time. Including Ray Santos, who we found out is dying of cancer. But... We can at least help him around Trumbull Valley for a little while longer while he has the time. And, uh, do our own helping of buddies that we have made around here. Which, you know, it's a decent number of them. And then, I guess, taking out the play cards. Which is really the best way to ensure all of them people are safe. And then we'll talk to this survivor, I guess. Mainly because they are right there waiting to be helped. Then there's also the remainders. I have a lot of things to do, but we will get that done next episode. For you!